Well, guys, I just have to do a special midnight edition of... <laughs> oh, Lord, I left out of here <coughs> right when this damn uh, UN climate report was just hitting the mainstream media, just hitting the mainstream media, right when I was walking out the door and uh, come back uh, 12 hours later. It's now midnight. It's, this is not April 1st. It's, it's a few minutes in April 4th, 2022. And uh, so I turn off the mainstream media, the number one story on the planet, Earth headed toward climate disaster. Earth's temperatures will shoot past a key danger point, bringing dire something. What must be done? So <laughs> I, I click on the number one story on the planet. Uh, <laughs> I cannot believe that Yahoo News went with it. They could not resist it. Somebody at Yahoo News has to be a doomer with a just a dark, twisted sense of humor. The number one story on the planet in 2022 is IPCC window to avert catastrophic climate change is quickly closing. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> I'm going to have to send this one to my buddy Elliot Jacobson. Uh, Elliot did uh, a video a few weeks ago about the window to avert catastrophic climate change is quickly closing. Uh, anyway, when did... I think we first heard that in 1988 we saw that headline. Although uh, I kind of remember it from 1948 on our in our plundered planet our plundered planet 1948 uh was the first time talking about the window is quickly closing and i guess uh climate change piped in a few years later oh jesus <laughs> oh boy The jury has reached a verdict, and it is damning. It is damning, and it is dire. This is our old buddy, Antonio Guterres. This report of the IPCC is a litany of broken climate promises. It is a file of shame, cataloging the empty pledges that put us firmly on track towards an unlivable world. You tell them, Antonio. <laughs> oh, please. Uh, without a dramatic shift in policy, we are on a fast track to climate disaster. Yes. <laughs> The window is rapidly closing. The window was nailed shut 30 years ago. Anyway, you just got to love those, uh, those apocalyptimists at, uh, <laughs> at the UN. It, again, it, it wasn't the IPCC who said it. It was the uh, politicians who overrode them. Still pulling out the window is quickly closing. <laughs> I'm going to bed.